Hey, if you're a frequent flyer, you know how exhausting the lines and delays at many airports can be. Los Angeles International Airport is trying a new program aimed at making travel a little less stressful. Kristen Dahlgren has more. Lines, delays, security, stress. Travel can leave you feeling totally licked. Give kisses. Oh, yeah. Give kisses. Hi. Hi. Enter man's best friend. And George, get unstressed. Oh, oh, oh. Los Angeles International Airport just launched a program that pairs up the delightful dogs with passengers who might be ready to growl over the hassles of air travel. Hi. You want to say hi to Finn? It's called PUP, short for Pets Unstressing People. It's palpable. You can see the change. You can see people start to smile. Marwick Kane and his dog Kai are part of the 30 dog volunteer program. Certified therapy canines who wander the terminals. And it's cleaner than our dog. Bringing smiles where they aren't always easy to find. Does Finn remind you of your dog at home? Yeah. Even just petting something nice and soft just helps relax him rather than having to have to go to the bar and have a drink, you know? <laughs> Brian Valente awes passengers with his massive wolfhound Finn. It completely changes their worldview. They have to stop and say, what is going on here? There's plenty of scientific research that proves pets can help lower blood pressure, aid in recovery after heart disease, even help with self-esteem. But our unscientific research here proves that people just can't get enough. Handlers are respectful of those with allergies or fears, and they go through extensive training. Miami and San Jose airports now have similar programs, seeing the same success. He's a big buff ball. Who wouldn't want to hug on him? At LAX, the dogs have their own trading cards and are building quite a following. People from other countries are calling about the program and asking how they can start a program. Perhaps a little pet therapy coming soon to an airport near you. A new way to de-stress frazzled passengers. As simple as a canine kiss. Thank you. I needed that. For today, Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News, Los Angeles. Very cool idea. Love it.